bro, complete. Done. Some time has passed. I went and ate some food real quick. And now we're recording again. Uh, Wait. here's a part that's bullshit. Well, one of the middle guys. Okay. Let's see if that mixed with this deals with it. God damn it. Yeah, there's treasures all across the wall. I'm just gonna snipe them now. I was hoping I was getting clever with some of those uh, with some of those cheeky mind darts. As you guys saw last part, I've been starting to rely on mind darts. Well, I have a lot of pistol ammo. I'm just gonna kill them outright. Fuck right off, dude. Come on. They just said a dialogue line I've never heard. He's gonna throw it. Is it playing through my TV? Ooh. Let's get rid of that volume. All right. Oh wow, they died in one shot. Oh, I guess that I guess I must have clipped it. Got one with the mind dart. And then I procked the other. Oh yeah, make sure you guys get all these treasures. Velvet blue, spinel. Yeah. Green gym. Oh yeah, I think you get another elegant mask coming up. Yeah, I think you get another elegant mask coming up. Follow me. I'll have Ashley actually follow me now. Oh yeah, fun thing uh, is if you go to which one of these windows is it? Oh no, no. It's, it's right over here. How do I get out? God damn it, I forgot how. Oh well, figure it out in a minute. I think it's through the next area. I think I'm just being, I'm too quick on the draw. Was that the queen or the king? Let's try the queen. It was the queen. We're good. No, sorry, I, cl I clicked before I, I clicked before I looked at the actual statue. King's grail, queen's grail, done. Nothing sitting in these chairs. All right, cool. Let's keep moving. Yep. All right. Yeah, I was just being, I was being too, uh, too quick on the draw. This is the, this is the area. Oh yeah, I forgot about that snake. Bastard. I knew I well if you've actually watched the series, Jake, proving you haven't, I've killed every other snake. Keep on trying to Yeah. What? I uh moving too fast sometimes. Yep, here's the window. You just go over here. And you just go all the way around here. There will be a treasure chest. New butterfly lamp. And the reason there's a new butterfly lamp something you'll see interesting is because those dungeon monsters you see it to see again catch Ashley and now that you're coming back you get to see the red herb that sits across there you go another full heal health extender yeah here's an area that's interesting I can say, to say the least, you want to use the rocket launcher in the way I'm going to use the rocket launcher. You may see it as a waste, but I promise that it's not. But you're going to want to clear out the enemies first. Don't start with the rocket launcher because you need as many gems as possible. So you're going to take like 10 steps forward. Ashley's gone again. Who fucking, who's surprised if I'm honest? Now you want to run back, kick this open. 
and head into here. Once again, just a simple old choke point. See, I don't know if a flash grenade even affects them. Guess we're about to see. No, guys, did the research for you. Flash grenades, no effects. Just start running. Honestly, that is what this hallway is always for for me. It's for backing the hell up. Is there one above my head? No, there's one way down there. I can't remember which one we're after, which gym. But there's three greens in a row, a blue, and a green. Do we need any of those? Nope, we need reds. Yep, we need two reds. Red, green. All right, here's where you want to use the rocket launcher. Don't miss. You did that to get all of these. There's a red, there's a red. Perfect. Yeah, now there's a fucking thousand reds. Who the hell's surprised, honestly? Sometimes RNG just fucks you over, but you gotta, you gotta persist, cause then you'll get, then you get stuff like that, where now I have two butterfly, butterfly lamps. Perfectly done. Let me eat an egg real quick. Turn the lever. Done. I think there's another area involving these dickheads. I think it's the next area. Oh, by the way, in that cutscene, Ashley was kidnapped again for the millionth time. In case anyone's... Uh, she gets kidnapped in the very beginning, of course, the initial reason you're playing the game. She then gets kidnapped right then, whenever you get... when you deal with the... Uh, when she runs through the puzzle. Then she gets kidnapped again here. I think that's the only time. Welcome. Got some rare thing. What are you what? selling? Well, where you have to save her from that? that all? That's whenever she runs all the Is way down a hallway, <laughs> just just for some. Thank you. Some reason. Is that all? For for reason. Is that all, stranger? <laughs> Is that all, stranger? <laughs> ah. <laughs> ah. <laughs> Thank you. You want to keep the green gem. What are you buying? Is Red it, 9 it, upgrades. It, it, That's what I've been waiting what for. You Buy. Buying? You want to buy another rocket launcher. Strange. You want to always keep one of them. <laughs> Thank yeah, you. it's a full playthrough, walkthrough. What are you buying? That's what I market it as. Of course, you want your mind dart thrower to be as powerful as Come possible. Always. Because that thing's overpowered as fuck. It can clear out whole groups of enemies. Got six shots with the mine dart. And I have well over a hundred and some ammo. Well, I should probably reload my shoddy. And uh, is this fully up? Nope. I had some, I had some, you could, oh wait, I'm not done with the animation. There was one little click I had to do. Re-equip this. For my general guides here, I like to always keep a rocket launcher. That's why you save up as much a much money as possible. Because you're going to need a rocket launcher, especially towards these later parts, because there's a part in a ma about a minute or so where you're definitely going to need a rocket launcher. Which is that, uh... Which is that two... Ch not chainsaw, that's a chainsaw. Those two gladiators I was telling you about earlier. You're going to need a uh, rocket launcher to... I don't know why he's walking. I missed, like, a fucking scrub. Got him in the head that time. 
Yeah. Yeah, so there's a point coming up that's going to be very important that you have a rocket launcher. Because it skips an entire boss fight. Here's where you fucking book it, else you get hit by a catapult. This part's kind of dumb, kind of not. I like it. It added a, uh, it added something different. But it really, because it was like, oh, you have to avoid certain areas like you did with the, uh, with the initial entrance of the castle, which is then something you never really see throughout the rest of the castle until this point. I don't know, I like that kind of thing. I like it adding new aspects to the game. More mind darts. Those are very useful. Yeah, those are the catapults way over there. Actually, I think I broke them. Oh, I guess by sniping those first two guys, it makes it where the catapults don't spawn. Hey, pro strats there. Snipe the guys from across with your rifle make, to make it to where they don't spawn. A uh, lot is, uh, since you're watching this, this is going to be a thousand times easier for you. Uh, instead of going to the top of the fucking thing immediately, look up in there. There's a piece of wood. And, uh, look around a little bit more. I can't remember if there's another one this far down. Do not believe there is. Uh, Gonardos were assholes. Put wood in the thing to make it to where you couldn't... Couldn't go places. Uh, I went down on accident because I'm stupid. Headed it up. Yeah, you can shoot through the metal for some reason and hit the wood. Look, more handgun ammo. Uh, yeah. Yep, and the last one is right behind you. You climb up. So in those three places, you can break the wood that are supposed to slow you down so much so that they escape. And they even leave a note up here to tell you about it. But yeah, it's that easy. Now you deal with enemies on the way down. Just sitting here waiting. Checking my mic 13 minutes in. You gotta play this game a little bit more tedious whenever you're on professional. Cause a lot of shit will fuck you up really bad. Okay then. Honestly, I don't know why he didn't just punch the shit out of me. These guys have significantly lower health than I would have thought. Two shot it honestly. What are you saying, Jacob? I don't know. Boom mic's pretty sharp, but you guys are talking at normal levels, so it is able to pick you up. Well, yeah. While I'm while I'm in animation lock, he's gonna fucking hit me. That's in Resident Evil 5. Yep. In Resident Evil 4, because you actually reach down to pick shit up in animation. In this game, uh, if you're doing a kick, they can't hit you. If you're doing a vault, they can't hit you. And if you're doing a, uh, 
A ladder jump. I think it's any in Resident Evil 4 and 6. Or five, sorry, 5 and 6. Yep, somehow, sure. Once again, animation locked. Here's where you utilize dynamite dip and shit, and you just stand right here. Oh, did he already kill himself? God damn it. Yeah, he already killed himself. Let's not knock dipshit off. And let's go over here and grab this treasure. Reload. Grab my handgun. Why? And sometimes it makes you turn in a weird way. And you'll get fucked over by it, but... You just gotta be fast. <sighs> so the upcoming part is bullshit and you'll see why. Do not progress forward in any way. If you do, you'll encounter a hell of a lot of fuckery. What you wanna do? Mind dart, center guy. Oh well, it shifted. And then just get your sniper rifle out and wait if it doesn't kill them all. See now it's tempting to run forward and grab that treasure. What you wanna do is walk over and save. Cause the next part's bullshit. Yep, because now you're surrounded. In which, the best thing to do is throw a grenade, pull out a pistol, boom, rush this way. Yeah, I think one of them had a rocket launcher. Not sure much I could have done there. God damn it, one of these is a fucking parasite. Damn it! Boom! Just every single miss that I could have possibly had. There we go. Come on. No, I missed the rifle ammo. God damn it. Alright. You'll want to advance. Don't do that. You'll advance. You'll want to advance. Don't do that. Reload all your weapons. Should have utilized the mine dart thrower more. A little upset that I didn't. A little upset that I let that one shot land on me too. I should have been able to react faster. 
Alright. Now you want to save again. Because the next part requires perfect accuracy, else you have to restart. Because you don't want to waste this rocket launcher, period. If you use the rocket launcher, you want to make sure that it lands. Here's where you uh, abuse the system. Don't move, and they're not going to attack. Gives you optimal time to aim. You aim for right there. Did I get it? Nope. Nope, missed it. It's a little bit better. Right there. Nope, I missed it again. Yep, just keep reloading. Let's see if I can... Can I get the skim off the ground? Right like that? I think that's the best we're gonna get at this point. It's kinda dumb though. So, I don't know, I guess it's different on professional, but on normal, if you land that rocket launcher perfectly, you can usually fuck off the second guy, but maybe it's different on professional. Or maybe I'm just still bad. Who knows anymore? I got hit once. Upset. Just lost a bunch of goddamn ammo, too. Hopefully I can do this still. Oh look, you also have a cool bell you can now ring as many times as you want. Of course, if you're trying to conserve money, don't don't fire a rocket launcher at that guy. That's a straight up insta kill on both. I'm a little upset that it wasn't. I'm upset. Wish that would have been an insta kill. <sighs> We're doing good though. Hey, the left and right hand. Mr. Kennedy, don't you know when it's time to throw in the towel? No! Leon! Somehow this doesn't rip my hip completely out of socket. Hmm. Where's the satisfying sound of one's impalement? Don't fall for this old trick. Chapter done. Ah, oh yes, here's something you do not want to immediately sell. As always, the prospect is promising to just sell it immediately and get all the money, but you want to save it. More money is coming if you do. I'm gonna 
if you can get these bats to drop anything. I think still no. Oh yes, here's where I'll show you that key treasure I was just talking about, the crown. The crown, if you examine it, it'll tell you a crown with two divots like something fits inside. Like something might fit inside. So, you will now, and look, you cannot combine it. So you know that you do not yet have all the parts. So do not dispose of it. I think if you climb up here real quick, you can get something, a treasure. I swear there was a treasure hidden around here somewhere. I'm just losing it. Welcome. Ignore me. Ignore me. Got some rare. All right. What are you selling? Let's sell some stuff. Let's sell my spindles and velvet blues. Is that all? <laughs> Is that all? <laughs> Thank you. Sell the gold old? bangle. <laughs> Thank you. What are you buying? Tune up. Here's the striker. What are you buying? Also called a jailbreaker shotgun. Don't know why it's called jailbait shotgun. Jailbait shotgun. I don't know why I call it the striker in this game. Where is my riot gun? Here it is. Ah, I'll buy it. In a yep. <laughs> Sell your shotgun. You buy the striker. Is that a Take up, takes up less space, far better shotgun. Thank you. And I think that is Boy, right now. What are you nope, I can see my inventory. I'm missing a rocket launcher. And you're going to need a rocket launcher for the upcoming fight. So buy another one. <laughs> Thank you. And... Uh, yeah, you can, once again, you can still buy the Broken Butterfly at this point. Do not. You honestly don't want that Magnum. It's what bad. What are you selling? Right. Right. Tune up. Now is I'm willing to tune up my shotgun, because this is my end-game shotgun. <laughs> Thank you. Done. Come back anytime. Now you'll want to save, because the upcoming part, like every other part in this game, is tedious. Cutscene as to where you were like two seconds ago. So obviously, the right hand, I think is what it is, is following you. I think that's the right hand. I don't think it's the left. I'm pretty sure he joins uh, together to form Super Salazar with the left hand. Yeah. And cutscene? Well, give it a minute. Cutscene. Now you get to deal with it being a dickhead to you from the ceiling. By the way. I'm gonna go over here and grab this stuff real quick. I'll need that full heal in case he lands a blow. Nothing responding. Power out. Which obviously sends you on a very obvious quest. I said obvious in two different ways. Make sure you keep dodging. That is a hell of a hit. I'm just going to all the different areas to pick up everything. <laughs> 
Now remember, he is not going to appear until you activate the thing over here. So take your time and pick up all the stuff. Just make sure you keep dodging his attacks. Like, hold on, there's another one coming. Alright. Now to activate it, he will be here in a moment now. He's gonna drop down like right in front of you. I think you have to run all the way over here. Hold on. Alright, here he is. You liquid nitrogen his ass. Ooh, he's kind of close, but you have to pull off the rocket launcher. And he's dead. Crown jewel, you want to slot that into the crown to increase its value. Then there's one more. I think you get it after killing Salazar. I'm not sure. I can't remember exactly how to get the uh, the other crown jewel. But yeah, here's like a thousand nitrogen tanks all the way through the area. It was gonna be a bitch to kill that guy if you don't use the nitrogen tank rocket launcher combo. And make sure you do knock down the nitrogen tank. It may seem like a waste of time, but he is a uh, enemy that can use animation to uh, avoid an attack. Much like whenever you fight Krauser later, which I'll show you, you have to be absolutely perfect with it. You have to nail him while he's stuck, while he's staggering, or in this case, that was Krauser, or in this case, whenever they're nitrogen, because it slows them down enough to be able to hurt them. It seems that Salazar... Speaking of Krauser, that's where you first see him. Save game. We're doing good. Covering a lot of ground. Loading it in. Uh, we need to buy a new rocket launcher. I think, uh... I think the fight with it comes before the fight... Salazar. Welcome. Got some rare. What are you buying? Buy a rocket launcher. Strange. Rocket launcher. Sit it down. <laughs> Come back anytime. Oh wait, I forgot to tune up my weapons and sell because I think I have something I can sell. Selling? I am selling. The is that spinels, is that the velvet blue. Thank you. Oops. Oh yeah, I think I sold I sold everything I can. Time to tune up. Mind dart throwers, firepower. Before we continue now, I will be saving. But I will now be doing the shooting gallery. The next one. So, from here, it will be cut. Okay. And now we are back. Just finished yet another row, and to prove the row is complete, and there it is. To where with that kind of with that game, Ghost Recon Wildlands, I'll probably just have it to where we're gonna do something stupid, and I'll upload that. I don't know. Jeb, I don't know. I do not know what I'm, my plans are for that video, or for that game. I'm still doing Resident Evil right now. Hold on. Dude, it's the village Gennardos. We've missed them so much.
Dude, I've missed these guys. There's a velvet blue in there. Make sure you get it. I think it's hard to see from the side. Ammo and pietas, patas, pitas. Caution overload. I think there's dynamite in there you need. Oh, here's where you get to fight Dr. Salvador. <clears throat> Again. Yeah, it's, he's called Dr. Salvador. His name, his name's in the, uh, I think I just got something thrown at me. His name's in the bottle caps. If you get all the bottle caps, it gives a name. It's the chainsaw guy, though. Here, you've pulled the enemy's aggro, just back up. Yeah, there is a uh, there's a video, a lore video one guy made where he d does believe that they're all the same person. Uh, yeah, I believe the video is very compelling. Yeah. Yeah. Switch to this weapon. Put a couple on his head. Let's walk into here. Wow, I'm missing every shot. God, I am garbage. Got him in the back of the head. How much ammo do I got for my handgun? It's still a lot. Still should keep using it. Oh, nice dynamite. Throw it. Throw it, you pussy. Throw it. Oh, wow, buddy. You just gonna run up to me? I was expecting you to throw it. Just take this. Need to move. There we go. Nah, he's gonna try to throw at me. I'm just gonna rush him and get him in the chest with a shotgun. Like that. Done. Done. Let's just keep Obviously telling of the incoming Gonardos. Grab the Pitas. Check out the Plagas. Where the original mining operation happened underneath the castle that allowed for the allowed for the last Plagas to resurface. Boom! Right in the head. That. that was a loud ass noise. Let's get him before he lights the dynamite. Shoot him in his ass a couple times. You're using a wired controller, right, Jacob? Okay, cool. Reload. We're all good. Make sure you go back here and get the gold. Don't want to miss out on it. It's free. Alright, yep, now we're gonna flip the switch. Oh wait, the electricity, I forgot. Why I climbed up there? I'm dumb. Pull the lever. I can't remember if he spawns now. Nope. There we go. As much as you think there'd be a spread with the shotgun, if you don't have the laser point directly over the item, it won't work. Here's where you get to fight Salvador again. Oh, 
Except this time, as you would have ex as you would expect, it is a very trivial fight with almost zero difficulty in it. There's enemies running up behind you. Make sure you get your back to the, not the wall, but you wanna get them to where you can back up a little bit. Knock these guys down. Knock that down. Don't want to waste all my mind dart shots, so I'm gonna use a hand grenade here. And now I'm gonna shoot him in the head until he's dead. He's dead. Like I said, that fight, that part's kind of disappointing. He's very trivial there. I think his other appearances and his later appearances is definitely the more riveting gameplay from Dr. Salvador. Right there, a shotgun blast, a couple mind darts, then another shotgun blast and a grenade. And some headshots, it was done. Have I not? I flipped the switch, didn't I? I need to flip it again. Yeah, okay. That's as for getting a crucial part. Take the velvet blue. All right, let's grab this enormous stick of dynamite. Enormous bundle of sticks of dynamite for some fucking reason. Yeah, let's give him the classic. Let's just beat him down and cut him with a knife. Classic save ammo when you don't need to save ammo. Yeah, really. All right. Ugh. Reused boss fight is reused. Let me see if I can pick up a couple. Uh, yep, a little bit of shotgun ammo before this fight. Uh, it's two Elga Gigantes. <laughs> so what I'm going to do is I'm going to make one fall into the lava and I'm going to shoot the other with a rocket launcher. This is really easy. As usual, it is merely tedious. Avoid the lava pool, you can reach up and grab your ass. Yep, you win. Just stay away from the lava pool for a minute. Because until it closes, you're not safe. You are now safe. Yep, that's how easy that boss fight is. It took, what, an extra 20 seconds off the first one? Because I had to drop one of them in lava before rocket launching the second. Very simple. Kind of dull. Can't remember. Nope, nothing's up here. We're good. Also, once again, with the inconsistencies, you'd be fucking melting anywhere this close to lava. Alright, let's get this and keep moving. Alright. <clears throat> oh yeah, here's the next area that's bullshit. Not two seconds after, you just had to fight two El Gigantes after fighting a Chainsaw Ganardo, also known as the Dr. Salvador. You get to fight these things.
What? I think when shot with such a high damage weapon over the uh, cliff, I think it kills them instantly. Yep, awesome, missed. Pull up the striker and see if I can nail him with a shot. Let's get out the pistol for this next part. Nope, he's dead. I think this is the uh, puzzle clue. Okay. I'd love an explanation as to how it cornered that well, but all right, sure. Yeah. Real cute. Dead. I don't think there's another butterfly lantern, so you can just sell the shit out of those when you get a when you get the chance. I'm not gonna waste a full heal. I'm just gonna advance until I reach the choke point, which is right here. Just spray. You have plenty of handgun ammo. <laughs> yep, once you trigger a spawn, just run back to your choke point. First, let me be a greedy bastard and grab these shotgun shells. As always, it's more easy to deal with them in here. It is easier. dead. Green eye. We're waiting on the next one. There he is. Dead. Rifle ammo. Where are they? All the way over there. Alright, cool. <sighs> nope. Missed. I hear one getting closer, and I don't know where it's at. I'm gonna retreat a little bit back. Just go like this. Ah, he's right there. Missed a shot as usual. Pull out this big boy. Knock him out of the air. Use this to. Oh, already dead. Never mind. Grab this. I don't want to reload. Grab that. It's one of those things. It's the rarest. Not a, not as my playthroughs go playthroughs go as you guys have seen but I think on like a numerical standpoint the blue is the is the rarest yeah let's just hit the button and spawn the enemies because honestly this is starting to seem a little endless yes press it and let's deal with all the enemies coming in Use our handgun to try to dispatch this one over here. Done. There's another enemy coming, I can hear them though.
Missed. 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 Oh well, let's fuck it. I'm done trying. Let's just go over there and shoot him with a fucking shotgun. Let's strike her his ass in the stomach. To be honest, I've never really spent too much time in this area. I always just... I always just leave. But I'm really seeing no reason to be in here too much. I don't think there's anything hidden away that's gonna help me. Actually, I guess I should probably dispatch it with something else. I should just dispatch it with a striker. We're actually running lower on handgun ammo since we've been specifying using it. Alright, let's hit the button and get bum rushed. Alright, press it, and enemies will flood in. Have a grenade. I do. Awesome. Pull the trigger. Everything should be dead from that. One on stands. Done. There we go. Area pretty easily dealt with. Yeah, that's unreachable. Can I press the button? I feel like I pressed the button. Oh yeah, I pressed the buttons. Okay, we're good. Went silent for a little while there. Sorry. Oh uh, yeah, once again, that's what Re Resident Evil calls a puzzle. I think if you fl don't flip the switch, it does something. I can't even fucking remember anymore. Oh wait, I think the Royal Insignia is the last thing you need. For your crown. Yep. Your crown is now the Salazar family crown. A complete crown with all jewels and insignia set in it. Now, I would give up every single bit of fucking money it gives me if I could just put that crown on and pimp it through the entire rest of this game, but not an option. So, I have to sell it.
Okay. Okay, let's combine some herbs. Well, that's the only herb I was actually combining. Rocket launcher. Stranger. <laughs> Thank you. I forgot to turn off the audio on the TV again, didn't I? Yeah, uh, I may have heard that either. Yeah. It's fine. My boom mic wouldn't pick up something like that. Is that all, stranger? <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Is that all, stranger? <laughs> Is that all? <laughs> what are you buying? Is that all? <laughs> I'm starting to run low on. Yeah, I'm starting Thank to run low on stuff. Selling? On ammo. Well, not ammo. Is Money. That old stranger? Is that all? <laughs> Thank you. Oh my god. Yeah, no, no. Once you get them up on a cliff, you can't take them down on a cliff. Is that all? <laughs> Is that all, <old> stranger? <laughs> Is that all? <old? laughs> Is that all? <laughs> Thank you. Ah, I'll. <laughs> Thank you. I guess I'm not as low Come on money as I thought I was. Time. All right, that's where I'm gonna call part five or six. I can't remember which one it is anymore. It's part six, right? Yeah, this is part six. All right, make sure you like and subscribe, and I will be making the next part immediately and uploading it.